Hi, everyone. Um, I want to welcome you to another Android app review here on Echo TV on YouTube and Android phone app reviews.com. Um, it's a pleasure reviewing another interesting app, um, an app that can anonymize your traffic. Let's see. Um, when you go to the web, the website detects where you're from, right? I'm currently in Lagos, Nigeria, probably Nigerian. But you know, there are some websites that do not like where you are. They don't like your place, and uh, because of that, they will restrict you from browsing their websites. I don't want to mention any names. Um, now when you're faced with such a challenge, all you have to do is install this app on your Android phone. And with this app, you don't need any special proxy websites, none whatsoever. Uh, you can browse whatever restricted websites that you want to do. Um, it's on the Play Store. All you have to do is search for robots. So, um, once you search for Obot, you should be the first in your list. Yeah, Obot Proxy. Um, there is also all web, private web browser. I'll talk a little about that too. Obot Proxy is the application that helps you to, that does the main job. So, um, it's, very, it's free of charge. I've installed it already, so I have to do is open it after installing it. Okay. They ask you a few questions English yes I speak English of course so this is a little description it helps you defend against content field train traffic analysis and yada 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 click on next okay so it automatically anonymize my traffic that's exactly what we want so now all bots require permissions but if you do not have roots you could check this so you understand and click on next but i have roots okay if you don't have roots you click on this that means for you to be to browse anonymously you need the or web which is obot web browser okay but if you have roots access which i do um, if you want to learn how to roots go to echo.com.ng um, you see a full article on how to root any phone you want to root. Okay, echo.com.ng. All right. So since I have root access, I click on this. It asks me, "Is I set up transparent proxy? Do I want to proxy your apps through Tor? Normally, that's usually the case. But if you want to select individual apps like your browser, WhatsApp, whichever one, that's where you select that. Okay." and uh, it asks me for so many apps where i can select yeah uh, this might take me some time okay but still let's just go back i just want to proxy all apps so click on next now these are the apps that work with all bots yeah i mentioned all web just now if you want to browse in case you're not rooted it's good for you if you want to chat securely give a bot if you want to do deep search doctor go google does not search everything but doctor go yes it does proxy mobile add-on yeah if you use firefox you can add this to your firefox and it allows you to browse anonymously too um if you want to use twitter you want to browse anonymously on twitter you can select that too so any of them you can select down down google play store and select them and it will work for you but i click on next and uh, i click on finish and i'm good to go so it's currently deactivated to ask me for super user there's a point where i ask for super user i click grant and yes the toast comes up i've been granted super user permissions and to activate all bots all you have to do is click and hold and then all bots start and give it some time to set up to enable try and connect it bounces off the relays you know and let's just give it like 
few seconds okay so um, I believe by now it should turn green I don't know what I can wait for it to turn green yeah okay let's try it out go to my browser remember I am in Lagos right yeah let's see where we are now now one thing about proxy surfing is when you are surfing through a proxy you are going through many hops not just you have increased the number of hops the number of routers which you have which, are, which you have to bounce through If you increase the number of authors which you have to bounce through and uh, that means that it will take longer to browse unlike without a proxy okay here we are now my IP address has changed it's now it's 6.59.13.107 which was different from the 196 or whatever I have before uh, my host name changed you don't know me dot at my proxy location look at that I'm using an anonymous proxy, a high anonymous proxy. That means, as it stands now, nobody knows where I am, nobody knows where I'm browsing from, and yes, I'm good to go. I could access Netflix, Pandora, Spotify, any website I want to access. I can do that now. Isn't that great? So, it is good for you if you are restricted in a way like me I'm restricted um, if it's good for you if you're a security researcher and you want to do some penetration testing yes it's also good but please you need to use this wisely as uh, your actions could also be traced even though your location can't okay so I hope I've been able to show you how to surf the web anonymously um, you can always come back to androidphoneappreviews.com for more you can check the YouTube channel Echo TV and you'll always get the best of Android app reviews. So thank you very much and have a great day. Bye.